and in that day shall ye say, Praise the Lord. What a joy it is having you come into our space here where we can minister the Word of God to you. And we're coming to you today with a message that has been preached somewhere around the world. Something like Santiago. Don't know where he is. I just pray that you'll be blessed, inspired, healed, delivered, set free, fear gone, faith arise, and that you will receive today from this preached word just what you need. Thank you so much for being here. We lean too heavily on one side of the jaw. There are nine teeth over here. But there are also love, joy, peace, long suffering, gentleness, meekness, temperance, faith. You can't deal with the devil just by the power gifts. You also need the fruit of the Spirit. For it's love that makes the gifts work. If you don't love me, you can't deliver me. If you don't love me, your prayers are in vain. It takes love to activate the power. And that provides a balance. And I might be able to love you. But if I can't help you, then that's nothing either. We need a new job book of an ass that has the gifts and the fruit. Understand, it's not fruits of the Spirit. It's all connected to one jaw. It's the fruit of the Spirit. There's no such thing as having a whole lot of love and no joy. It's love, joy, peace, long-suffering, gentleness. It's all connected on the bridge. Y'all know my bridge, don't you? It's all connected. And what we need is our gifts and our fruit connected so that we can wield this jawbone in power, in love, and in authority. I, I'm coming back, I'm, 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 I'm through here. But I want to bring this out, that once Samson used the jawbone, he threw it away. And the Bible said he was so worn out, so weary, until he cried out, I need some water. He said, God, are you going to let me die for lack of water? May I say to you that after you get through praying for the sick and they recover, you need some water. You've got to throw that jawbone away that you used, as it were, because you cannot rely on what you had yesterday. If you're still talking about, I remember when, then that's a sign that you need something now. 
fresh from God. Hallelujah. 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 Somebody say fresh. This is what we need from God today is something fresh. Lord, I feel it in the house today that we need something fresh. A fresh anointing. A fresh revival. A fresh wind of the spirit. Somebody leap up and say, God, give me the fresh. I can't hold on to what I had yesterday. I need something new. I need something fresh. Hallelujah. 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 What I had in the past was good for the past. But I need something new for my situation today. Somebody holler fresh. I believe in the next three. Whoa, Jesus. I believe in the next three minutes that God's going to blow a fresh wind in this house. That God's going to blow a fresh wind in your spirit. That God's going to blow a fresh wind in your lives. You're going back to your home with fresh. You're going back to your job with something fresh. Say yes. Stand on your feet. All over this place. Lift your hands. And expect God to send a fresh wind. A fresh anointing in your lives today I want you to begin praising him and begin worshiping him begin pulling on God for that fresh thing that you need in your life for that fresh thing that you need in your marriage for that fresh thing that you need on your job for that fresh thing that you need in your own life began speaking Lord something fresh 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 come on lift that voice in praise Begin lifting your voice in praise. Woo. A new job on a new anointing hallelujah a new quickening new mercy new peace new stamina new endurance new strength fresh 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 Somebody holler fresh! Hallelujah! 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 Ha oh, hallelujah! Just start picking up a new job bone. Start picking up a gift. Start picking up something fresh for your life. Just reach down and go through the motion and pick up a fresh jawbone. Pick 
pick up something new in the Holy Ghost. Pick up something new in the anointing. Something fresh in your life to deal with those on your job, to deal with those in your home. It's a new beginning. I hear God saying that he's going to take stuff out of 07 and bring it into 08 and change the nature of it. He's going to bring blessings out of what you went through. He's going to bring something new out of what you went through on last year. Start praising him for it right now. Start thanking him for it right now. Start glorifying God right now. Hallelujah. 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 You're in 08. What does 08 mean? It means new beginning. New beginning. New beginning. New beginning. Tell somebody I'm embracing a new beginning. I'm putting my hands around a new beginning. Come on, tell somebody, I'm putting my hands around a new beginning. I'm not going to be attached to my failure anymore. I'm coming into my purpose. I'm coming into my destiny. Come on, step into something new. Come on, step into something new. Come on, step into something. Come on, step in to something new. Shake yourself from your past failures. Shake yourself from your past failures and tell the person beside you, I'm stepping into something new. All things are passed away and behold all things have become new somebody shout if you believe it Just shout at somebody and tell them new, 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 new. I'm shaking myself from my own. I'm not going to let folk tie me to my failure anymore. I'm not going to let people tie me to my disappointments anymore I'm not going to let anybody hold me to my past because I'm stepping thank you so much for tuning in to us and I pray that you have been blessed and inspired delivered set free and healed if you have been why don't you sit down and send your gift to us $22 that's what I'm asking you to give that will denote what God is going to do in your life for the rest of this year. Be blessed. Hopefully we'll see you on tomorrow.